Our breaking news is we come on the air right now. All four people that were being held hostage are safe now. Here is a live look at the congregation Beth Israel in Colleyville, where a suspect held them against their will for 12 hours. We can tell you law enforcement officers are still surrounding the area. They have come from various parts of North Texas and of course the FBI. We have multiple reporters and photographers covering this story, but the bottom line is all of the hostages are physically unharmed and safe now. I'm Chris Lawrence. I'm Cynthia Aguirre. According to multiple sources, the suspect is dead. In the coming hours, we'll hear from authorities on scene about the suspect, the hostages, and exactly what unfolded tonight. The call came in after 10 this morning. The congregation Beth Israel is on Pleasant Run Road, not far from the DFW area. And this just in, Chris, I'm being told by Colleyville uh, PD that there will be a media update here in the next 15 minutes. Yeah, we've already been told that four people were initially taken hostage, but the suspect released one of them around five o'clock this afternoon. And about 30 minutes ago, Governor Abbott tweeted that the other three were released safely. And again, multiple sources are telling WFAA that the suspect is dead. We have team coverage tonight. Yeah, let's begin with Adriana de Alba with what just happened in the last hour, Adriana. Hey, Cynthia and Chris, well, things definitely uh, escalated over the last half hour. We were waiting around for details, any updates, and then we heard a loud bang followed by some shots. Now, minutes later, Texas Governor Greg Abbott tweeted out that all hostages were released safe, alive and unharmed. You know what a day it's been. And that's truly, truly the outcome that so many all around the world that have been watching anxiously were hoping for that everybody would be safe. Uh, so let's take you back to how this all unfolded because it's been quite the day. It all began at 10 this morning with a Shabbat service at the Beth Israel Synagogue in Colleyville, a quiet moment of worship when suddenly at 1041 AM police got the call that a person went into the Jewish synagogue and held people hostage. It unfolded during the synagogue's live stream. ABC News confirmed that at least four people, including the rabbi, were being held hostage inside. More than six hours passed after that. The FBI negotiated with that person. This was a massive scene all day long involving federal, local law enforcement trying to bring it all to a safe and peaceful end. And then just after five in the evening, a male hostage was released unharmed, sent to reunite with his family. At that point, three other hostages were still inside, but we have since learned that all of the hostages are released and safe. What a day. It's been 11 hours since this hostage situation began. And again, everyone, the hostages are safe. And like you said, Izzy, so, so many of our sources with FAA have confirmed that the suspect the hostage taker is dead, and tonight all of the hostages are alive and safe like everybody was hoping for. I'm live in Colleyville, Adriana de Alba.